Okay, today I'm going to share with you a couple quick tips on the Adventure Zone. As I um, have already completed my Adventure Zone and already grinded it out, on two occasions, uh, two different groups were complaining about me building with metal. And one, was, one group was saying he didn't have metal. So I'm just going to share with you the best place to get metal is on the top of the giant ca castle. The entire roof is a metal roof. And if you just bust open every single panel on top of that roof, you'll get a thousand to two thousand metal in one ten minute match. And you can do this during a uh, resupply if there is a resupply available a mission. Or you could just do this during a mission and while your group is messing about. Another tip I would like to share with you is increase in difficulty to the max sometimes isn't as productive as you might think but it, if you want a quicker level up then yes go ahead and uh, knock yourself out running around the map for 45 minutes in some cases one person will be collecting the blue glow it'll take them around 40 minutes to collect that enough blue glow and in that time you could have completed one or two other missions uh, if you haven't completed every single mission of the day yet like for example if there's like a an encampment mission or something still left over that you want to do so is leveling up uh, the extra difficulty always good uh, in my opinion it's not you know uh, one or two levels up is fine but there's no reason to rush or make the di make the level any more difficult than it is in some cases because in several matches I have lost because we raised the difficulty up and then uh, once they raised the difficulty up they didn't even add enough traps to defend it correctly so it was kind of more hilarious than anything and the last tip I would like to share with you today is I had extremely trouble getting my xenon bow this season and I didn't get that xenon bow until I was at the last levels and the only reason why I got it was was a mission that you have to bust open 12 different chests this mission is also great for that because during a uh, more difficult mission it's harder to farm chests and it's more stress on your team members so it may be best to try to solo that in a survive the night mission and that's what I did for about 10 of my chests for that final uh, chest mission and it worked out great for me I, also during my chest grind I managed to find a xenon bow and a high level a neon sniper rifle which is one of the two weapons that I always prefer to use during my venture grind unfortunately I only had a couple levels left before my level 50 max but it was very enjoyable that I did finally find a xenon bow and for the last couple levels it, it should uh, it should help out a lot the best weapons to have in my opinion and the extra super duper bonus clip I'd like to share with you is don't forget to become a wolf by liking and subscribing and if you're already a liking thank you for subscribing